Greetings everybody, Hokage Games Online! Welcome back to more Wario Land 3. Last time. Although we didn't make much progress, per se, uh, we did get 100% in the Colossal Hole and 100% in the Forest of Fear. And in this episode, we're gonna start by getting 100% in the Warped Void. And oh boy, is this place gonna be warped. Well, you already know that. You don't need me to tell you that. Well, let's... I don't think... Yeah, we can't get over there. Well, it was worth a shot. So, as usual, we're gonna be going through uh, the basics of things. Like, areas we've already been to first to get those coins. Alright, well, the place that makes the most sense to use this would be here. So we can have you come chasing after me. Oh! Uh, you know what? It may make better sense to grab that first. Because there's one coin, and oh look! It's a second coin. All right, now that we've done that, I believe there's... Oh yeah, this room. How could you ever forget this? There you go. Another coin. Uh, excuse you. Hmm. Oh, I know where. I know where the next one is. It's actually in the same room. Because if you go over here, we saw this before, there's a coin there. But it looks basically impossible to get, right? Oh, well, screw you too. What you actually need to do, and this is really clever, you gotta become Flat Wario. And fall down here. If you go across here for long enough, careful not to fall in this water, because that would suck. You can fall all the way down here. Oh, but then there's also the issue of... There you go. Takes a little bit of finesse to get it, but it's still easy to get ish, if you put enough time into it. Alright, so that should be half the coins, correct? Yes. Alright, so now there's gonna be a tiny bit of confusion, at least for myself, because the next place we need to go is back to the beginning. Problem is, I do not remember the best way to get there. I would like to think that this takes us back to the beginning. Uh, nope. Where? Oh! Takes us here. So you can break those, and that does lead to the next room, yes. But, of course, nothing's ever that easy. Hey, look, another music coin. I hate you. I hate you so much. Yeah, here's the beginning room. Oh. Actually, I think the one I was thinking of was the one we just got. Alright, well, there's a little bit more work that needs to be done, first of all. For one, uh, I forgot where things take me. I know which way I gotta go. I remember... That was an awful throw. Can we try this a little better now? That I would call a better throw. Scr don't you dare! Ah, uh, you jerk! 
Alright, why I am heading up here is because... Those who remember... There's a coin there. Problem is... How do we get to the coin? Well... You get to it the straightforward way. See? So that's six coins now? Yes! So there's two coins left... Uh, somewhere in here. Can't say I know where. Well, where do you take me? Back to the beginning? Nope. That'd be too easy. Oh wait, you actually do basically take me back to the beginning. Just somewhere where I didn't think you were gonna put me. Alright then. So back to progress, because the last two coins... Yes, last two coins. Are in... The new area. Which we saw the door to get to the new area, but we didn't go to the new area itself. Which is why we're heading there now. It's an... Actually, yes, it is this door. Perfect. Let's get over all you. We already destroyed these blocks. Into the new area we go. Welcome to the new area. It loves these purple blocks. Absolutely adores them. Well, there's one coin. Yeah, both these coins are gotten in the same method. Unfortunately. Shoot, there better be more here. Yes, there is. Alright, cool. Looky there! Alright, but where do these take me? Well, that takes me to this room. Wherever this might be. Oh, we need a donut, dude. Oh, hi. Where's... The... Is this... Yep, this is where the chest is. Alright, well, we did the hard part. Well, I've been trying to, so... That's done for... When we... Hit later. Where are we now? We're here. Wherever here is. We got two different doors. How about this one? Wrong door! Takes us back here. Alright, what about this door? Hey, look at that. Come on, throw an apple at me. Laura's well, gotta eat. He hasn't eaten all day. I haven't let him. That's all we need to do. But now we gotta go the long way again. Imagine that! That's fine. Memory servers, it's this door we need to go to. Crush me! Can fly down here! Fly down there like the Wario we are. Grab the blue key. Where... I believe this way? Not the way I was intending, but it works. So we are just about done with the warped void. In fact, we are now done with the warped void. 100%. That took about 10 minutes. That's a lot longer than I was expecting. Look at those eight coins. <sighs> we did it. All right. So now that's actually 100% most of the east levels. The only ones we don't have 100% in are Castle of Illusions and East Crater. A little crazy to believe, isn't it? All right. Next place I want to go to is 
Yeah, Tidal Coast. So, uh, excuse you, fire. Is there anything in here? Is this where we need to go? Yes, it is, but there's a catch to this that I have not said. You might have noticed from my visits to the Tidal Coast, uh, at nighttime, the tide is higher. And because the tide is higher, that's why we can get to this room. So, what I'm saying is, this is a nighttime only chest. Don't think about that statement too much. Hey! I remember this section also sucks. So this might be where we spend the rest of this episode, is climbing. Climbing, climbing, and more climbing. So you gotta dodge those guys that are on the vines, and you gotta dodge these birds. There's gonna be one right here. Yep. Let's go under you. So here's the green chest. You can see it within view. Uh, that's not a big deal. Actually, better question. Is the green key here? Because, you know what? You know what will suck? Is if we're going through here for 10 minutes or so... Only to discover that the only thing this way is the green chest, and the green key is somewhere else. In fact, I th that might even be what is happening here. You know what? I'm not going to chance it. Where is the exit out of this crazy town? I have a feeling the, the green key is somewhere else. So let's put that theory to the test. Well, there's nothing here. Was there anything in here that we did? We can't actually do anything here yet. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Could be crazy. Been told that before. Actually, there's a door here. I don't think we ever did go in this door. Sure, get more coins, why don't we? Good, we made onto the door. This looks promising. Ellie's promising for, hey, there's something here. I told you! I told you! Learn to have faith in the neck. Unless you already had faith in me. In which case, continue. Knew I wasn't crazy. I'm also very glad I did that, because I would have hated to get to that treasure chest only to find out I don't even have the key. Because I absolutely hate this section. This section sucks. It's not fun. And there's a lot of other things I could say about it, but I'm gonna spare you from that. Right, go down. Yep, I knew. I almost forgot that bird was there. And then I remember that bird was there. And I got smart. Ooh, nope. Alright, well, at this point, if we fall, that's not a huge issue. It's gonna, uh, from there, be uh, tightly get around these guys. That's not what I wanted. Alright, well, we don't have to do that much backtracking, to be fair. Only a little bit of backtracking. So a little bit is less than a lot of it, so it's good in my book. There's the treasure. 
Speed running tactics for the win. Unintentional speed running tactics at that. Yo, you speedrunners out there, you should probably try that. A town in chaos. So I don't know if you're aware, but that actually means we can now 100% complete a town in chaos. We only have two treasures from it, but the third one did open up to us. So let's go... We'll get one of them, and then we'll open up the next episode with 100%ing Town and Chaos. But I, I don't know if I am... You know, I can answer that question. I'm not looking forward to having to 100% complete Town and Chaos by getting all the coins. That I can say I'm not looking forward to. What is... Oh, I see where I need to go. That's... That feels kind of weird, but alright. I'll play your game. So let's carry... Hi. So you found me... Taking your brother hostage. No, we want to head here. So we do need these gloves. Wow. That was an... Uh, oh. Oh! Never mind, I see what the trick is. I feel... That is not the trick. You know, I'm having trouble getting to this treasure chest. But I remember, because of how it's designed, this treasure chest takes a while, so... Oh boy. Maybe doing this was not a smart plan, but we're doing this now, so... No, what we need to do is toss you there. We want to leave you there for now. So that way you can do this. That is the trick. Now, welcome to where we're spending the rest of this episode. Oh, wait. There's a door here. Duh. Yeah, welcome to where we're spending the rest of this episode. Oh, we, we need you again, sir. You asshole. I don't even... Is there a method to where you go? Or is it just luck? Oh, he's just slowly starting to gravitate this way. But only slowly. You know what? There, there's a way better way to do this, I'm pretty sure. And it is... Like that. That's the better method that I was not smart enough to think of. Alright, throw you through these throw blocks. And get used to seeing that switch, because we're going to be hitting that switch a lot in our journey here. Because this puzzle... Sucks. For the reason that it is incredibly time consuming. There's a number of switches throughout here, as you may have been able to figure out. And you gotta use these switches to be able to navigate your way over to the key, and then navigate your way back to the door. Hmm, I have an idea. If this idea works, it's gonna save us a little bit of time. But I'm gonna try it. Yes, we can go up here. Hello there, bats. Ah, that doesn't affect me at all. Well, that's lame. 
All right, water. You want to hit me? I might actually be using a method that I never thought to try. And if this method works, then... Well, damn. The method is not that. Ah, oh, I thought I was being smart. I really thought I was being smart. Actually, it could... S no, I don't think it will, unfortunately. Good. I don't know. I don't think it will, unfortunately. Nope, it won't. And I know why. Dang it! I was hopeful that would work. It would have saved me so much time. Uh, fine. I'll do this the boring way, then. The boring way is to head in here. Hey, look, it's these jerks. Oh, boy. Yeah, we're gonna unfortunately bump into you. And it's gonna be not fun times. So let's respawn the enemies. Oh, yeah. We do need to do that. All right. I had to make sure we absolutely had to do that, and yes, we do, unfortunately. Uh, red coin, you're lying. We're close to the green key, not the red one. I'm not gonna question, uh, coin AI. I almost said key AI. <sighs> now you're done burning alive. Hit that switch. Hit that sweet, sweet s switch. Those? Yep, those bats are still there. Feed me! Now that we've done that... <sighs> I am angry now. I am incredibly angry. Why? Why would you do that? Uh, the thing that hurts more is I could have prevented that from happening. You know how I could have prevented that from happening? By not trying my stupid shortcut. I'm mad. I burp when I'm mad. It was probably not a very audible burp. Because I don't make a lot of those. All right, well, now that we know what we did wrong... There. And this is why I hate this puzzle room. I should... You know what I should have done? I should have gone for the blue chest, because that would have been less time-consuming. And then saved all of this for when we have to go get all the, uh... For when you get all the coins, but nope. Of course I didn't. Well, we've got the key now. All we gotta do is make our way to the chest. Which, that part should be easy. It's just getting the key that's a pain. Here, in here, ground pound. Like, I know there's a lot of tedious puzzles in uh, games that aren't designed to be puzzle games, but this is pretty high up on that on my list of those. Screw you. I'm not getting turned into yarn today. Alright, bats. 
We gotta go flying. Flying up here. Hang around here, get turned back into normal Wario. There's the treasure chest. It's the other golden eye! Well, this cutscene looks slightly familiar. That allows for us to get 100% in the Tower Revival. But, that's gonna do it for this episode. Got 100% in the Warped Void, and we did another two stages. And this one took way longer than it should have. So, next time on Wario Land 3. We're going to be heading back into a town in chaos, because we can get 100% in it now. And after that, we're going to go get 100% in the Tower Revival, and see what there is after that. See you guys then.